now, live from the Coca-Cola Southwest Beverages Porch. Good morning, everybody. These two Native American fashion designers are just back from New York Fashion Week. They're here with us this morning on the Coca-Cola porch. We have Lee McCormick and Kels Cooper, along with two models who, who you'll meet in just a minute. But first, good morning to you both. Thanks for being here. Good morning. Good morning. You just got back this week from New York Fashion Week. Mm -hmm. What was it like? Um, busy. Uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, we had a lot to do. Um, lots of running and pinning and dressing and undressing and yeah <laughs> overall though went well yes yes it went very well we got a very good reception so you were featured at the rise nyfw event uh -huh. tell us what that is that is a an organization that promotes people of color in the fashion industry so um if you're a person of color that is a fashion designer and and you would like to be in New York Fashion Week, they, you can apply with them and they're very supportive. Um, I talk to them all year round. Uh, they call and check up on me and stuff like that. And they're very supportive people. So you all are promoting and showcasing indigenous people in the fashion industry. Why mm -hmm. is that important to you all? Um, you know, we're, we're not a huge population. Um, we used to be, but we're not. And um, for us to have representation in all spaces, we're worthy of it. And so we need to be out there in the front of everybody. So you've you know. got two models with you today. Uh -huh. So let's let's bring, I don't know if you're doing it one at a time, bring them out and showcase what, what they're they're wearing. And these are the, the dresses that they had on at Fashion Week. Right. Um, my my design that I brought this morning, Gabby is wearing. Um, it's inspired by uh, Gentlemen Prefer Blondes, the, the Marilyn Monroe number where she sings Diamonds Are a Girl's Best Friend. Um, I took the, the print is a print I designed. It's a medallion from the mounds in Alabama and I colored it contemporarily and then made a print from it and that's what I used for the fabric and then Irene Creek made the beaded collar. That's one of our traditional things it's that gorgeous. we wear and I'm using it as a contemporary accessory. Tell us what tribe you all are with. I'm Muskogee. Okay. And we have another model with us this morning. This is Lauren Summers who's coming up and this is uh, your model. Yes. Well, this is your design. Yes. Um, so this look was inspired by the film The First Wives Club with the all white. The shirt uh, was inspired by my grandma's signature and our fight for sovereignty. The pattern is um, uh, the Cherokee syllabary and the ribbons represent the four directions and um, I aimed to create patterns that I could easily recreate for custom orders and the earrings are on loan from Weyama Pay. So, so beautiful. How long have you two been designing? Um, I have for about 15 years. Okay. Um, I started doing handbags uh, in 2001 or 2021 I mean and I've made I make one-of-a-kind bags and I've made almost 700 now <laughs> so this was my first attempt at designing clothes but <laughs> wonderful work it was a Hollywood theme we thank you both for being here with us and showing your beautiful work and I'm sure you'll be back at New York Fashion Week again next year is that the plan Maybe, maybe Milan. <laughs> oh, Milan. I like yeah. that. Dream yeah. big girls. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we will get all of their information linked over at our website. And while you're there, if you have an idea for our porch segment, you can submit it at newson6.com slash porch.